So today we go through all of the mischief tour in one go apart from this one which I got by mistake um, So it counts for the total amount of time that you have ever spent in a firing So if you've done all of the grand tour which you should have uh, If you have done that and you've got all the way to here and you have a rainbow luck spike Technically you probably should have this because you've gone to the volcano and you've gone to the ridges so you should have had the total amount of time done inside of that and you would have got it but the first one we've got to do is get a goal okay let's try that uh should be over here somewhere i should probably put the rainbow luck spike on because i'm gonna make people upset like why aren't you using the coolest bike in the game man why are you doing that luck spikes are so cool okay here we go i'll make some people happy here we go uh where is the beach hall it's over here. Right. We have to push it over there. A lot of people struggle with this. Uh, personally, uh, skill issue. But uh, I don't know how you're struggling with this. Because it's, it's, it's kind of straightforward. Just take it slow. And have control over the ball. And you will be fine. Literally, all you have to do is like this. And you will be absolutely fine. Just bonk it over there. Hit it with the dead center of your wheel. And you'll have a bit more control over it. The only bit that's hard here is when you have to push it up the hill. Uh, because it obviously rolls back a little bit, but if you if you just keep control over it like this You will be completely fine doing this I'm Just gonna fast forward this up because obviously it's gonna take me a little while, but I'm still gonna be able to do it Oh, it actually didn't trigger okay fair enough. That's kind of valid. It doesn't work for some people but it isn't that hard. Like, it isn't... I'll do it again. Oh, I need to, for it to... Okay, okay. I've been proven wrong. Okay, sometimes it doesn't work. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, maybe this one is bugged. I, I'm very sorry to all the people I doubted saying, Oh, this, this isn't hard. I mean, to be fair, it's not hard to get it in the goal. That is actually facts. But, like, it, it not triggering. I, I, I fully believe you use luck now. How many goals do you want me to score, mate? Sorry to all the people that I doubted. I genuinely didn't realise that it was broken like this. Where has it gone? Maybe if I load into something and load out, it might work. Uh, it's over that or you need a fresh game and then it works. I'm just going to restart and see if I can get it to go. Right, okay. I freshly opened the game. I've joined a lobby. Going in first person. I'm on a rainbow luck spike. So maybe it might work. Who actually knows? Right, and then go over this way. Yep, uh, that way. Nice. Through here. Oh, yeah, we can go through here if you like. Not into the corner, though. Well done. This way. Nice. Where have you kicked yourself? Over here. No, where are you going? This way. There you go. See, it does work. You just have to give it time. You just have to give it time. It is possible. Try and do it on a fresh open of the game. I think that's the bug. If it... So, it... I think it automatically loads straight away, but if you load into an area and load out, it doesn't work. So try it on a fresh, uh, a fresh open of the game, and I think it works as intended. Right, now we have to uh, lean on our back. As we're right next to this one, we may as well do this. Okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? What? He's got a mind of his own. I can't... Uh, as soon as I'm on here, you cannot control where you're going to go. So, I need you to just just stand in the middle. That's all that... You, yeah, don't... No, no higher than that. No. No. Where are you going? No higher. Where are you going? Stop going this way. I Go, go the other way. What are you doing? Go... You're meant to stay on here. It's not a hard task. Stop dry, stop moving. Stop moving. Stand just jump in one spot. It's not that hard. I've learned how to front flip off of a bloody bouncy console on my own. And I did it with nobody's help. And you telling me that you can't jump in a straight spot. Are you telling me that? Can you can you stop falling off? It it's not hard to stay on a bouncy castle, fella. Is this the hardest is this the hardest one? It, because you are an idiot. Is that why we can't do this? Yeah, deserved. I hope you snapped your spine, mate. Honestly. It, it, it's not that hard to stand still 
on a bouncy castle. Thank you very much. Jesus Christ. Right, into the shed because I need to change bike to this one because otherwise the frame doesn't properly bounce off of the table. You need to hit this table here, right? On that table, you need this bike. You need to roll through this middle bit, go all the way up this hill and you see where it just stops at the top. This is where you need to start, it's over here. And sometimes you do need a little bit more speed, so you might need to roll a bit further up. But most of the time, you should be fine if you set a marker up here, I think it is. If you set one up here, you should be completely fine. Right here, we'll do it. I literally just need to turn around. Right, you're gonna stop, you're gonna press Shift and T, or push in uh, brake and the Brake, okay, brake and the left stick if you're on controller. That's how you set a checkpoint. Right, and then we ride as fast as we possibly can through here. Then we're going to lean back and jump at the same time, and then we're going to mess up. It's so much easier on controller. Can I control my, can I control my guy, please? Right, well, you're meant to be coming fast down here. I don't know why it's not letting me go fast. And you're literally meant to bounce off this. There you go. See? There, I, I know how to do it. It's, it's quite straightforward. Once you know the lineup, it's easy. It's like any other thing. Right, I'm going to build a custom track. If you have gone, which you should have done, all of you should have done this. You should have gone from the highlands to the peaks and done it. If you haven't done that, first of all, you're bad. Uh, I don't know how that's even possible. Because you should be able to play this game by now. But if you haven't done that, and you want to set a boss modifier, you need to go from the highlands to the peaks. And it unlocks the fact that you can do that. And then all you can do is ride over to the train and literally set a checkpoint in front of it and just go on it. That is how it works. I'm telling you now. And you need to be able to do this because it makes it so much easier. You can obviously do it without if you want to. But it's easier to do it with. And I don't get how people haven't done this yet. It's so confusing to me that like nobody's bothered to like play the game and then they're like oh I can't do this thing it's like they it's like they open the game for the first time go to here and then go to here and then literally just go to this and then that's all they've done is is literally I don't get it you should have played the game by now it's it's so confusing to me right I'm just gonna make this uh not not and not and boom because I need to ride all the way to the finish to ride all the way back up to the start. And it actually works a bit better if you do it this way and just make it completely flat and straight. Obviously, you can do this. Or you can just go into the career mode and do it. But I'll quickly zoom down to the end and zoom back up. I'll just fast forward it so there's no cuts or anything. So you can see that that is what I've done. And then once it's obviously ticked off, it's ticked off. This is a lot of curves. What is this game, man? I put zero curves. What is this? What is it going on? I don't need to be turning over here. Please stop. And done. Hey, there we go. Oh, okay. We've fallen over, but it's okay because we've done it. End track. Yep. And then we're going to press continue. Go straight back to this and literally just go over and turn that on. And let's go. I need it to get out of the floor at the right time. There we go. Right. Oh, no. Get on. Get on. Get on. Get on. Get on. What are you doing? Get on the train. Oh, get on the train, man. Uh, it's fine. Actually, you're on the train. Can I get it by riding this way? Am I totally not riding on the train right now? <laughs> there we go. There's the train ride. You have to actually get it from the right direction. Okay, well, that's that's quite simple. And then that's what, that one done. Right, heading over to Descenders Island for two... I, I mean it, two of the uh, bits here. You have to do two separate things. And one of them is to come over to this thing that's over here. Which is... Where is... Is this guy just constantly riding backwards? What is that guy up to? Does he know that you can just, like, leave and rejoin and he'll spawn at the start again? Uh, we need to go over to here to do exactly what that guy did. Forklift gaming. I, I understand what you're up to, mate. Can I get up this? No. Right, now we're actually over here and not hitting our head on a silly little ramp. Do not crash into that. I would be fuming if you just make me ride all the way over there again. I'm going to set a thing here just to make sure that I can actually do it. Knock on the door. Hello. Thank you very much. And then we'll ride the lift up. I'm on. Hey, here we go. Are we at the top? I can't really see. Oh, we're at the top. Here we go. Um, where is the thing is what I'm after. It's right here. 
and then all you got to do is literally just ride off. Hey, and whilst you're doing that, you need to then ride over this way, I'm pretty sure. One of these has its behind it, and I and I think I remember it's it's one that's over here, I'm pretty sure. Either that or I'll see it. It's one of these has the coin behind it, and I can't remember what one has it. It's here. Here it is. Okay. Can I ride over to it? I can. Okay, nice. Yeah. Here's the coin. It's behind this one. Boom. There we go. And what we're going to do is end track, press continue, and actually not go into the other one because we've got to get this one. Uh, could you turn the camera around? We've got to get this one that's all the way over here. This one's super straightforward. Just going to set a checkpoint in case I fall over trying to get it because it's only here and I almost I already messed up. Hey, you lean up. Okay. Can you not? I don't think you can go in that way. I think it's a bit too short. But that's fine because uh, all you got to do is ride up this big bloody hill. Uh, there we go. And I made it up. Turn around. Actually, set up, set up, making, setting a marker just to be safe, honestly, is just so much easier. And then set another one and then ride forward because it's, it's just here. It, I, you see what I mean? If you're on keyboard, it's so impossible to jump. There we go. You got that one. And then we move on to the next area, which is ride. Free ride. Uh, no, it's not. It's bike parks. And then you go into Stoker. Sto yep, Stoker. And then for the Stoker one, it's a big, big ride up this hill. Up we go. Uh, all the way to the top. And then the higher up you go, the less polys this hill has. You'll see all of a sudden, it gets jankier and jankier and jankier and then all of a sudden it's like riding up a bloody 90 degree thing like this you see how janky this thing is look it's just boop 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 and all the way up to the top and collect that there we go right uh and then we exit out and then we go to another one what one is next? Die Fi Valley. This one's super straightforward and also really close. These are never too far from where you've got to be unless you do the Mega Park one because that one's miles away. But this one is you turn around and ride down this big, big service road and do a little jump because there's jumps here. Someone's been down there because the cones have been knocked over. Skirt around here. You've got to make sure you survive though because this is it's super fast coming down here. Well, it can get fast. Over there. Oh, another jump. I'm taking it the cars use those as well. Because otherwise they wouldn't be there. Right around this one. And it's on the back of this truck over here. And this truck doesn't have any collision whatsoever. So you can just ride through it. On to the next one, which is... Uh, not New Lexico. That would be a hell... That would literally be finding a needle in a haystack if you did that. Um... A lot of lakes doesn't have one. That one has one. This one has one as well. I forget that this has this. This one's just a chaotic map. There's too much going on. And it's so, like, compact as well. Uh, I think it's this way. You have to go down around the corner. Oh, there's absolutely no noise. Oh, okay, now there's noise. I think I go left here. I don't remember. I know it's over where that guy is because he's found it. Look, you can see it. Okay, so it's this way. Ride this thing. Slow yourself down. Oh my god, so much chaos. Uh, un I, I don't... Oh, uh, I... Oh, uh, that. Yep, let me back. Try to... Okay. Why did I bail there? I literally landed on what you meant to land on. Set up checkpoint. My god, man. I'm pressing the button and you're like, Eh, no, mate. We don't want to do that for you. Um, over the bridge. Yes, over the bridge down here, round here, over this. As you can see, it's right there, but it doesn't matter because uh, I don't know why I died there. I, I, to be honest, I am an, I'm not a fan of this map whatsoever. I actually dislike riding it. I don't think it's that good. It's over here. Don't kill me. There we go. Just here. Collect that and get me out of here. That's another one done. Over to the Mega Park because it's the next one that has it in it. And this one is a bit of a pain to get because it's so far away. And it's actually just kind of tricky to get this one. You have to do a lot of riding. Uh, it takes a lot, a long time to get over here. Um, but 
we'll fast forward until we're there and just hopefully the fast forward is enough that you can see where i'm going to follow it and then you can make it there if not i've already got another video that covers that hey we're here and the one that takes absolutely forever to get to uh i think you have to ride off here right you need to get here yeah this is you have to get this yeah. Oh, I missed it by the slightest bit. And then you're on a loop, so you, you can't ride back to it. It's just a, it's a matter of just getting it right. You have to ever so slightly edge your front wheel over it because you've got to grip the, you've got to grip the wall. If you don't grip the wall, you're gonna miss it. Once you grip the wall, turn and hopefully you might get it. It is tough. I need to go slightly over to the left. Here might do it. Grip the wall. Yeah, you've dropped. You've just dropped, mate. What are you, what are you doing? I, I literally made sure you'd grip the wall and you just dropped off. That's not what I asked you to do at all, is it? Grip the wall. Grip. No, you've fallen off again. What are you doing? Grip the wall. It's not a hard task, mate. You did it fine earlier. And now you're like, ah, mate. Not doing it. Grip the wall. Grip the wall. Do not throw yourself off. Grip it. Grip it. Grip it. There we go. You grip the wall. Well done. Well done, lad. And you've missed it. Grip the wall. There we go. See? Once you grip the wall, it's not a problem. Right, let's get out of here because that's, that's super tedious to get over there, that one. You have to go so far for a tunnel that takes you about a minute to get through. Um, this one doesn't have one. This one doesn't have one. This one does have one. This is a nice little bike park. I like this one. Uh, this is number seven, if, I rem if I'm correct. Uh, actually, just go over here, because you need to go over to the dirt jumps. This is a really, really steep and actual difficult path to ride sometimes, if you send it at full speed. Uh, I'm actually going the wrong way, because it's not over there. That's how you get to the dirt jump. It's at the end of this thing. I completely forgot. You have to go over here, jump over this. These are some tough trails. They really don't like taking the impact. T like, how? Like, uh, is it designed wrong? Why can't I make that? I, th I feel like I'm riding it all right. Am I not? Even if you don't jump, you really don't make it. Right, I have to moon jump that. And that's almost too far. Moon jump that. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. As long as I'm still alive, that's all I care about. I don't really care about if I'm riding on the trail. I just need to get over there safely, if that's okay. Do not hit this rock, because it could kill you. Anything can kill you in this game. Right, over this way. Yep, dodge, dodge the tree. Um, I really, I'm, I'm actually really tempted to set a checkpoint, because I'm afraid that you might crash. There we go, you set one. And then we're just going to skirt in here, and obviously you can see it, because it's very big and it's very collectible. Right, and the last one is on the new little map that barely anyone's played, unless you've played this. Uh, go over all the way to the snowman's ball, because it's at the end. And then we're going to do a lot of pumping until we see a snowman to the right of us. Right, and now don't slide around when you land. Gotta hold space, because if you don't jump this one, it's really tough to make. I'm gonna set a checkpoint, because it's own it's on the next one, isn't it? Oh, uh, quickly, set a checkpoint here. It's literally behind this one. Here we go, for the last coin, and everything to be done on the Mischief Tour. It's just hiding here. There we go, scavenger hunt complete. And that's also the whole of the Mischief Tour done as well. Which doesn't have a thing that tells you you've completed the mischief tour at all. Um, we're going to collect our missing material bike and our Baybell uh, jersey. Collect our poopy bike. Our goggles. I don't know why these... I suppose because they're quite easy, but these aren't really good items. That's a terrible one. Ah, you suck. I really hoped that you would give me a lug spike from this, but you didn't. <sighs> this one's going to be bad. This one is bad, and for some reason this is a blue. I think this should be an extraordinary. I know that people follow the tutorial to find all the coins, but 
it is one that takes longer than the firing one but that's the whole of the uh grand tour and the encore tour completely done and we didn't get a luck spike from any of them unlike the last time we did it where we got two luck spikes out of it and then we get zero so that's good rng isn't it Thank you all very much for watching, and thank you very much to my money havers, Andrew, Graham, Luna, and Francis, and thank you very much to Finoid for making TikTok clips to the channel and uploading them. I really do appreciate that. Subscribe for more of this stuff, and I'll see you a lot later. Goodbye.